This is the first video of making uh, our Aircrete dome home. We first made a uh, concrete foundation, circular foundation on the outside, a solid concrete, and then the inside we poured Aircrete, but a much denser mixture, doing a little bit at a time as you can see here. Uh, notice that after the concrete starts to set, we can put wood down and start standing on certain sections of it to complete the process a little bit at a time. This is two people, a husband and wife, doing a little bit at a time. That's how we did it. Now the center, uh, where the center vertical bar is at, I use solid concrete once again for strength in that area. Now once you do that, you have to make many, many, many concrete uh, aircrete blocks and you got to keep the chickens away from them uh, and other animals and and gosh you got to keep the Sun off of it because you can't just have your aircrete just dry so quickly so it's a real challenge uh, but it can be done uh, I made the previous video on making aircrete it's difficult it's finicky because each batch is slightly different but yet you're trying to make batch after batch after batch after batch to get uh, to aircrete blocks. Uh, you can see here how I've made them and we decided to uh, make them uh, the thickness of a 2x4 because that's what uh, Dome Gear had uh, initially shown us. I think now they're using much thicker blocks. There's no uh, real good information as to how thick to make your blocks, but this is how thick we made ours, and it seems to have worked for us. And like I said, you have to make many, 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 uh, plan on making many, many, many blocks before you even get started. And it's, it's a challenge, because once again, each, each batch, it's difficult to get each batch to come out just perfect poured our foundation it did come out good now with an aircrete foundation you'll want to cover it with tiles uh, and that's what we're going to do later on but it is strong enough you can stand on it and walk on it but for long term uh, strength you'll want to cover your uh, aircrete uh, uh, floor with tile you'll want to tile it now uh, mudding up the blocks is a real joy to work with it's fun and easy goes together very smooth and at the uh, start you'll go kind of slow but then you'll get faster and faster as time goes on very easy to work with uh, enjoyable to start putting in place by the next day, what you did the previous day is, is starting to get hard and strengthen up. Bigger blocks used for bigger sections. It is a cheap way to build. It is easy to do once you get started. It's easy to show helpers how to help you as you're doing this. Uh, my uh, Aircrete uh, uh, stuff from Dome Gia did work uh, as advertised and it worked very well. But like I said, it is finicky making the Aircrete. I don't know if it's the um, water that we're using that's slightly different each time or if it's different bags of uh, the Portland cement, but it is a little tricky making the Aircrete consistently.